Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be updating Fortnite on your iPad. So let's just go right into your App Store. By the way, if you guys have an iPhone, iPad, up touch, this is the same thing, same instructions right now. So right now on the top right hand corner, you're going to see an icon right there. It could be your picture, your name, whatever you guys chose. And if you scroll down, you're going to see all the updates. At this point up here, we can just go into update all or look for that specific one which in this case, it's Fortnite. So finally, all the way down here is Fortnite. So we can just tap on update. If we don't see right here Fortnite for any reason, don't worry about it, just click on done for now. And then go into search, which is in the bottom right hand corner. Let's just go into search and we're gonna type in Fortnite. It's gonna come up with the app. Right now, it says that it's downloading because it's downloading the update and it's done. But at this point, you guys can click on right here on Fortnite and just click on update if you guys see an update right now. Anyways, once we open up Fortnite, which I will do in a second, it's gonna do another update within the app. So there's two types of updates that happen. One's from Apple and then another one's from Epic itself, which will take care in the app. So we're just gonna open up Fortnite. And right here we should see this. This is fine. This is just part of it. So right now it's gonna do another update where we can see this, it's 2.46 gigs. What I recommend doing at this point is just leaving your iPad hooked up some electricity. Doesn't matter if you guys have 100% of your battery, I still recommend doing that, just so it doesn't turn off for any reason. You do not want it to turn off when you're updating, just because it's, it's a drag. Sometimes you have to start from zero again with the update, sometimes you don't, but it really depends. Especially with Fortnite, that's a little bit glitchy still, well, we get those errors. So right now we're gonna have to wait for 2.46 gigs. Well, it depends how fast your internet speed is. So right now we're only at 9%. If you guys have really fast internet, those two gigs can go really fast. However, it's an iPad. So there's a limit of how much it can download and upload. So it does have that limit. It's not like a computer where it can go really fast. So you will have to wait. For most of you, this will not take more than 30 minutes. For some of you, this is a 10 minute and others, it just might be five minutes that you have to wait. Anyways, that's it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write them down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.